Yo, yo, what's good, everyone? Welcome to my channel. I am a sage who rises today. I will be doing the sun, a moon rising of Scorpio. So let's get into it. So, angels, what's the tea? So, you got little wolf girl. So, it says it's all right to be alone. So, right now, you could be feeling alone, and your angels, your spirit guides, want you to know that it's okay to be alone. And the next card you have is Dragonling Guarding. It says a new world is born. So while you're alone, you have a new world that's being born. Okay? This is giving strong wolf clan. It's also giving somebody did some type of moon magic on you, which awaken your people. And they want you to know that it's okay to be alone. And that you are about to have a new world that's about to be born to you. Yeah. A beautiful little worm. Take care of yourself. So yeah, you're being asked to take care of yourself at this time. You could be having people attacking a wound of yours. When I see little worm, this talks about, you know, you needing to allow yourself to feel safe. You know, you need it to go, like you have right here, little wolf girl. Like I said, it says it's okay to be alone. So you could be alone. Okay, or you could feel alone. But I really do feel like you are alone. But you do have people that's trying to attack old wounds. And this is why you're being asked to take care of yourself. Y'all know how in the apple, you had the worm. You know, the worm only gets in the apple when it becomes too weakened. You know... And this is what it's giving. It's giving like you could have been either attacked or emotionally abused. And, you know, people preyed on that. And you're basically being asked to basically heal yourself. You know, be in your little cocoon and heal yourself, man. Yeah, because you got somebody who was trying to scare you. A scarecrow. Mm-hmm. This is somebody who wanted you to be afraid. It says lost magic at women and rebalance. So you could have once lost something that you once was good at. And what are your what you're being asked right now is just to like be at one with yourself. So that you can rebalance yourself. Yeah, my life is sweet. An elder would teach you. I am reborn. Like, look at this shit. Yeah, somebody tried to scare you. I, look, bro. What I'm really hearing is somebody tried to bring fear to you. Because they felt like you were alone. But you have an elder teaching you. And this is why your life is sweet. So you once could have felt like, you know, why is my life so dual? Why is my life so... You know, dry. And this could be because you be in the house too much. You know, you could be hanging around stale ass people. And when the fever beat comes out, she talks about, you know, you need to realign yourself with people who are positive, that are light. And not by around stale ass branches. You know, bitches that ain't giving no life. Because this is making you feel like you ain't, you know, and that's not true. You know, you possibly need to bring flowers in your house to bring back, you know, your little spark. But, you know, your life is not as it seems. It's just you just been hanging around weird ass people. Because the fairy bee, it talks about when you read it, when you read this oracle card, it talks about, you know, you feeling as though, you know, what, where's all my shit? Where's what, 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 you know, where my shit at? You know, why my not coming to me and and it's only because you know you lied to yourself you told yourself that you wasn't worthy of it when in fact you are worthy of it like i said in the beginning you could be someone who feel as though you're alone and okay yeah you might be alone but you're not alone i'm saying that you needed this time to be alone because somebody was literally trying to attack you come for like wounds fuck with you mentally yeah, literally trying to scare you, man. 
But you got an elder here that's going to teach you something. Yeah. And you will be reborn. So I don't know. Yeah, look. I will show you who to trust. You got an elder with you that's going to show you who to trust. Uh-huh. So what we got going on? What's, what's this about? We got a Queen of Pentacles. So this could be about a Queen of Pentacles, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Two of Wands, the path that this person chose, Page of Wands to get good news. Three of Swords, they're heartbroken now. Eight of Swords in reverse because you're not stuck. With a King of Cups, Seven of Pentacles who was investing, Nine of Swords, some anxiety, sleepless nights on you. Yeah, with the Page of Cups, it's like, it's so crazy because we got the Queen of Pentacles right here. We got Queen of Pentacles right here. Why is this Queen of Pentacles? Yeah, we got Queen of Cups, Eight of Pentacles. King of Swords. So you could, you could be this queen of cups. You could have been somebody who was very in tune to your emotions. You know, you're very nurturing, kind, compassionate. You're very in tune with your intuition. And it's like somebody tried to play on that. Why is this queen of pentacles here? Five of pentacles. This is somebody that you're leaving out in the cold. Six of swords. You're moving on. Ten of wands. And this is weighing them down. High priestess reverse. This is somebody who... You can't trust this person. <laughs> The high priestess in reverse is a whore. Okay? This is somebody who sells their self out. <laughs> yes. This is a sellout. And this could be a Taurus, Aquarius, or a Sagittarius. This is definitely somebody who doesn't listen to their intuition. This is somebody that's going to also try to hold you back just to close out a cycle for you. Weird, motherfucker. Why is the two of wands here? I'm saying that somebody chose this path. Yeah, cherry to get success. It's Knight of Swords. So somebody chose a path because they thought they was going to get some type of victory and success. So they Knight of Swords you, tried to attack you. Six of Pentacles to take what was yours. Why is this page of wands here? Yeah. Somebody thought they was going to receive good news. Ace of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, in love and money. Fool card. This is why they took this leap of faith. Four of Wands. At a home or at a partnership or with a partner. Eight of Pentacles. This is somebody who worked very hard. Nine of Wands. And did not give up. Ten of Swords for trying to betray you. This person knew you was an earth angel. Seven of Cups. But they still wanted to put up some type of illusion. Three of Pentacles to a group of people they was working with. This is giving a King of Swords energy. Libra. Gemini on Aquarius masculine. Or this could be somebody who you already, you know, know. Yeah. With the Three of Swords, somebody is heartbroken. Because of the magic they did to try to slow you up. This could have been a Virgo. This person is heartbroken. Three of Cups, this was, a, this was one of the bitches who was a part of the trio. Six of Wands who wanted some type of attention. Four of Swords, now something is being laid to rest. Ten of Pentacles for this family. Same card, because they're being exposed by a Queen of Swords and a Queen of Wands from their past. Yeah, they missed the opportunity. Yeah, you're not mentally stuck in trial. I don't know who this Queen of Pentacles King of Swords. I don't know who these people is. But they really thought they had you in some shit. <laughs> they really did. They were like, oh yeah, I got her. I got him. You know. What we got? What we got for Scorpio? Yeah, somebody thought that they could tempt you with some type of sex. Yeah. This is somebody that's part of a wolf pack clan. So you could be a part of the wolf pack, the clan. Know that you are protected from moon magic, period. So relax. Yeah. Eva I. Yep. Somebody sent out some Eva I. And it's because they really offended by your strength and resilience. To never quit. This is the same person who can't stop missing you. This person thinks about you all day and night. Like, make it make sense. How are you thinking about me all day and night but trying to send me evil eye? <laughs> it don't make sense. But, hey, don't let them make sense nowadays, y'all. So why is thought they could tempt you with sex? Yeah, shoddy a bop. Yeah, this king of pentacles. This could be a Taurus. Six of cups from your past. Chariot that you had victory and success with. Queen of Swords, could you cut them off? Lovers, yeah, you could have had a choice between two people. Four of Swords and you laid something to rest with someone else. Two of Swords to the point that it turned to a stalemate. Yeah, and with the tower in reverse, you avoided some type of natural disaster by cutting somebody off. Why is Wolfpack clan? You are protected from wolf magic. 
King of Pentacles. Tower in reverse. Two of Swords. Let me see something. Yeah. Somebody is envious and jealous of you. You had a whole group here. Mm hmm. Ten of Cups. So you got people envious of your happiness. And this is why they want to cause the imbalance. Because you're getting victory and success over a Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, this Queen of Pentacles is getting exposed. Right along with this Queen of Wands in the distant horizon. For coming towards you with fake ass love. Why is evil eye? <laughs> Somebody evil eye pop. Yup. This King of Wands, you had an Aries, Leo, a Sagittarius masculine sending you evil eye. That shit pop. You got too much light that's being shined through you. This is your karmic justice. Ace of Pentacles pertaining to some some finances, four of wands that a couple received. Page of swords. These people are spying. Three of swords and they are heartbroken. So somebody is heartbroken because they went spying. And they're saying that you're stable. That you got money coming in. But this is your karmic justice. Yeah. This could be with a king of wands. Every Leo says the world who you close the karmic cycle with. Yeah, this could be the person that's really offended by your strength and resilience. Yeah, you got a king of swords. So, yeah, you got a king of swords, a Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius that's, you know, really offended by your skill for resilience to never quit. Nine of cups because you're receiving your wish fulfillment. Six of wands and you're getting public recognition. This is why. The fuck? This is a weirdo. Like I said, they can't stop thinking about you. But you're being warned, you know, caution, go a different route. Because somebody could be very demonic. They could be a Jezebel, Jack or Hyde type of, you know, whatever, you get it. Okay? Who is this that can't stop missing you? Scorpio, why is this here? Somebody who made a bad judgment on you. Four of Pentacles, this is somebody who tried to hold back from you. A King of Swords, Star card, this could have been an Aquarius. Three of Pentacles who worked very hard. Death card to end something for you. Temperance, now they want to balance something with you. King of Cups, because they're saying that you have full control of your emotions. Eight of Cups, and that you walked away. Devil from toxicity. Justice, but this is your karmic justice. To be in this King of Wands energy. To be this natural leader, boss. You know, why is warning? Caution, go a different route. Why is this here? Scorpio, why is warning, caution, go a different route here? Yeah, when it comes to a lover, okay, hermit, ghost this person, five of pentacles, do not invest in this person. Three of wands, because in a distant horizon, when you heal something, there's going to be judgment called on the queen of pentacles. This person is going to be exposed right along with the queen of wands so that you can be able to move alone. See how you in that cup, see how you in that boat alone? Yeah, you're going to be moving towards a king of pentacles. Yeah, somebody who you avoided a natural disaster with. Yeah, you're going to get some type of justice. Okay, for some type of demonic ass energy that was done. Okay, with the four of swords in reverse, somebody is not going to be able to heal. Okay? A lover? Yeah, because somebody was playing my games. Six of wands just to get attention. Six of cups in the past. And secret. Yeah, now they gotta lay that shit to rest. Why is demonic Jezebel? Who is this? Who is this demonic person? Ace of Wands, this is the motherfucker who took some type of action. Eight of Wands to project. Will the fortune on your destiny? Eight of Cups, this is somebody that you walked away from. A King of Cups, this could be a Pisces. But yeah, you got a Temperance Angel here. Yeah, somebody tried to end something for you, but they didn't know that you was gonna be able to transform. From what this group was working on. Yeah, you healed. You healed from whatever little duff little work these people was doing. Like <laughs> Boo. It's getting boring. 